We have not uh -oh. seen this before. We, we okay. did not so we're gonna okay. see this last year, because let me tell you why. We said it before the game. The Cleveland Cavaliers ain't beating this team four out of five games. No way. Because of the person that we're talking about, Kevin Durant. And the thing I like about his dominance, it ain't just against the shot against Richard Jefferson. He's doing it on purpose against LeBron. He's looking at LeBron James standing in front of him and saying, I'm about to get a bucket off the bounce. I'm about to go to the post. I'm about to go to the hoop. Do you know how demoralizing that is for the Cleveland Cavaliers when they know they only have one guy that can possibly stop KD and it's LeBron, yet he's still having his way? LeBron did have a triple-double. I want to talk a little bit about LeBron because isn't that going to be the argument that LeBron is the best player in the world, but he cannot there's do no, everything? There's nobody arguing that. Well, we some no, no. Some, the the truth juice Paul. over here. Nobody's <laughs> arguing He's dropping it. bombs LeBron, all night. Well, Kawhi there's is somewhere watching this game. He, there's saying. nothing okay. Durant can't do on the court. Correct. I agree with that. No, no. 100%, I mean, he's, P. 100%. But, but, but here's what makes it work. It's so awesome when your best player isn't ball dominant. KD can play on the ball, the off the ball, and now everybody else gets a chance to get involved. So now Clark can come in and get going. It, Clay Thompson can find a way to make shots. And you mentioned LeBron was terrific, but it just wasn't enough.